Okay. Hello, everyone. DS is on the mic. Bruh, I haven't done one of these in a bit. How has everyone's day been? As we get into the first game of the set with um, Arch Nemesis versus Zone. A very classic, classic matchup um, whenever he appears. But <laughs> so far, Nemi is looking not too hot at the beginning. Taking his first stock at literally zero. All right, here we go. Trains. Yep, catches the reset from the landing. Okay. Has to guess here for a positional advantage with the side B. Okay. Yeah, Nemi is very prone to just like sitting back and waiting for like his opening. Same with zone. So naturally, they're all both going to be looking for the same thing in this scenario. Looking for frame traps, looking for ways to actually like, oh, snipe him out of that. Holy. Good reversal from Nemi to get out of the corner from zone's oppression. And so far, yeah, nice. Confirm from the down air. And now it's looking very dire for our boy Nemi. As I say, when he gets that down tilt, start busting it. All right. So overcommits a little bit in the corner. Now he has to deal with Nemi. But so far, it's really hard for um, Ryu to actually get anything started whenever he's like playing in CQC, unless the opponent lands like that. Simply, if Zone isn't very careful when he tries to land, he might just get punished like really hard. He might take 30 for his troubles, even 40 if he's lucky. Yep, reset. Time to guess. Yep. Oh, we almost got it. Just going for the roundhouse instead. Oh, parry. Yep. Now Zone has to reset because Nemi is chasing. Good for there. Catch the landing. And now he, he's very, very... Oh, go, okay. Yeah, Zone is looking very confident in the, com in the corner. He doesn't feel too... Oh, my God! That could have been so bad. Yeah! Nice chase from Nemi. Those resets, you got to be prepared for them. Those little hiccups of the platform, you got to be ready for those chases. A good drift from Nemi. Not a thing you would see him do usually. He usually commits to just holding forwards to try and get the maximum drift of the Shaku. But he's actually just like weaving in and out with it. I like it. Rising back air. Poking on a big character. It's really dumb. All right. Taps him twice. Zone says he had enough of that. Oh, yep. And now, he, oh no, he gave away too much space from going f for the heavy version. Now he's in disadvantage. No. Okay, good, sure you. Having invincibility on the arms, making it very hard to hit him from like above. So you really have to like try and snipe him from the sides or from basically just if he overshoots. Uh oh, that's it. Well, that's kind of lame. <laughs> that's why Jump Tatsu is kind of peak if he just snipes it out of the air. Like, that simple. He did the right option, but it was just like, in that scenario, it was just really dire because Zone could just snipe him out for free. Right, looking to run it back. So they both do not see an issue with the stage. It's mostly just like little hiccups from Nemi whenever we're covering. He's gotten better with them, but it's just like he needs to tr try and force his own to like um, pick an option and make do with it so he can make it, make it easier for himself to recover because you cannot scrap on the way down because zone will be there to just like play ignorant. I, I like how he plays, I like to call Zone's playstyle an Emperor style. So like in fighting games, you basically play with the tip of your, it's basically like footsies, right? Playing at the tip of your like um, footsies reins. And he's basically just like trying to start something off, off of it now. But establishing that is not easy against the Shoto. 
as they're always jumping in on you and making it kind of an issue. Oh, nice! But that was not an issue for Zone, calling out the down air. What a champ. Oh! Where is he going? There's nothing up there! Classic call out with the Nair. Okay, dashes back in. Loving that stage control from Zone. Yeah, just playing with the Emperor style again. And keeping it very simple right here. Ooh, confirms off of the Shaku. Yeah, that's it. Ooh, he's cleaning up shop. Hold on. Okay. He answers back with the back air. Needed that instant reversal right there. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, you got to parry the... A couple of hits on the landing because the thing is you can parry the whole thing but you have to time it correctly and I know sometimes it can mess up so many opponents just from the hits alone oh good cancel okay holding holding his ground really well I like this from Nemi not overextending to try and hit him from ledge just really just trying to tap away at him but yeah zone is already frame trapping his landing it's not looking really good for our Shoto friend with the Ban Adana. Oh, yeah, you got to parry double hits. There's more triple hits on the landing. Oh, Ooh, nice. Back it already getting him. All right. Swinging. Yeah, he has to cancel off of it. Otherwise, Zone just grabs it. Oof, okay. Yeah, just back off. I'd rather just not deal with this right now. <laughs> I'll take care, dude. See us. Oh, back air. Time to guess. Ooh, zone already using it in the mid range with the down B. Still using it as a way to deter Nemi from just like shakuing for free from the corner. Because that's one of his biggest reversals out, out there. And I think this is that. This might be it. Oh, okay. Oh, punish. Nice. I love that co coverage. Oh, yeah, backing off. Oh, he's in the corner now. Oh, okay. Now, if Nemi holds his ground, oh, no. As I was saying, if Nemi holds his ground, oh, no. Oh, that's unfortunate. It happens. Like, you got to double dash forwards before like actually just like releasing it he was definitely really nervous because he was thinking he might snipe me out of this and it just like overwhelms them in the moment but it is what it is but wow good showing from zone yeah it is what it is glitchy Exactly, staying consistent. I love it. Can't say that for myself, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, glitchy. Since you're here, right? Bro, can, do you notice the fit? Do you notice the um, shoes? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah, it's based on Michael. Pretty snazzy, pretty snazzy. Oh, hello. Hey, Glitchy. Hey, Brennan. Glitch. What's up? I'm just here to say hi to Glitchy. Ah, <laughs> bruh. Not to me, moi. I haven't said hi to you today already. Yeah, but still, dude. Show, show off the, show off the, the oh, grip. I, I did, I did. I, I showed oh, him yeah. the shoes. Very nice. It's pretty snazzy. And then, like, if you see from.